And I'm just waiting for my coffee to uh, cool down a little bit while I'm doing that. This is actually a hell of a lot of fun. I haven't done it this way before. Um, this is also the biggest I've ever done. Um, so I'm just, uh, just yet again, just the concept. I, it's going to be, there's going to be a ton of mistakes, I'm sure. Uh, I just need to learn, is the concept going to work? Um, yeah, so I'm just doing, like I said, one of these tape plastic uh, transfer things, uh, overlays. I'm going to try it on that one of the canvas sheets. I'm just doing some hex paper here. And I've never uh, taken the paper off while in the water. I usually take it off. I was like, you know what, I'm just going to, while I'm waiting for the coffee, I'll do it this way. And um, yeah, it just reminds me of like, you know, if you're um, working in a negative room or a you know, processing area or whatever the heck they call it, and uh, darker, that's it. And um, yeah, it just kind of feels that way. Mind you, I'd be wearing gloves, I'm assuming, if you're aware, uh, using all those crazy ass chemicals. But, um, gosh, this is kind of neat. I'm going to maybe, maybe I can heat it, uh, reheat it or something. I don't know. But, uh, anyways, this is fun. I'm, I'm liking the uh, slow process of, uh, oh, it just feels nice to immerse my hands in warm water, too. And stuff like that. So, and we'll see how it comes out. It still seems like a while. I may have to do another rinse. I see bits of these paper, bit, uh, the paper bits are, well, that'd be neat, eh, to collect it and, and redo it as pulp in some wacky weird, weird way. I mean, you think about it, if I keep, if I keep doing this, I'd end up with so much flipping pulp, it's not funny. And um, I could redo it, then maybe make some, uh, some, uh, yet again, some uh, prop or something for my narrative play. That would be interesting. But you can see so far, I'll show it to you a little bit there. Coming along. Getting there. Getting there. Yeah, like I said, I'm just going to try it out and see if it works. Alright, I'm going to see if I hit the button without uh, pouring water into the camera.